Tukiangazia swala zingine za kufungamana na masuala ya kilimo ni kwamba taifa la Denmark limesisitiza kuwa miradi yao ya kupiga jeki wa kulima wa ndizi katika kaunti ya Taita Taveta haitaendeleza kilimo cha kutumia mbegu za GMO mbali watakuwa wa kilima kutumia mbegu za kiasili. Na mkesimio alikuwepo. Tusikie. Safari yetu inatuelekeza hadi mji wa Taveta. Takribani kilomita na kumi nukta tatu kutoka mji wa Voi. Eneo hili linajulikana kwa uzalishaji wa ndizi huku takribani wakulima elfu tano kutoka eneo hili wakitegemea ukulima wa aina hii. Denmark mmoja wapo ya mataifa ambayo yamekuwa yakifadhili wakulima wa ndizi. Mjadala wa mbegu wa vyakula vya GMO kitokota nchini mwakilishi wa Denmark Charles Wekesa anasema kuwa mashirika ya Danida na Mespit yatashirikiana kuhakikisha kwamba uzalishaji wa ndizi ya asili wala sio ya kisaki. I am sure this county it will be the entire county not even kwani peke yake inaweza kushibisha Kenya nzima. So wananchi ni siku njema na mimi namuomba tushirikiane na hao fadhili. Or else when it comes to GMO the, the, the government of Denmark will not take any position it support the county government the national government and the farmers to decide what they feel best for them hata hivyo kero ya mafuriko imelemaza pakubwa juhudi za kuboresha kilimo kuna maji yanakujaga mengi sana yanafanya uharibifu mbaya sana kazi ambayo imefanywa kwa miaka tano inaweza kuwa zioreted within a day rehabilitation of irrigation canals has been done and will be done to ensure that water is available while we invest in production and productivity this will be a fresh task if we do not engage in value addition it is for that matter that my government is on the verge of completing banana processing plant in this Taveta sub county k samuel runinga your citizen